Yeah, and welcome to episode 65 of my Kingdom Come Deliverance Hardcore yeah. All DLC playthrough. Previously, we did a little bit of treasure hunting, um, yeah. which was painful to say the least. And we might actually do just a little bit more treasure hunting on the way back, um, and then we'll start doing some yeah. start doing some quests. Have a couple of quests to do. Yeah, holy quacamole! How is it treating you? How's Divide and Conquer treating you? Um, yeah. Who did you decide to play as first? Are you an evil guy or a good guy? Did you crack open Mordor and just uh, straight into, you know, being the baddie? Or... Just hanging out in Kazadum with Balin. Hey, so you ended up doing that one. Question, question, has the script all worked correctly? It should if you do what it says for you to do. King wrecked by Durin's Bane, yeah. yeah so it looks like it has. Because I know with that one you have to f go exactly where the arrows tell you to go. If you don't go exactly where they tell you to go, then it doesn't, um, doesn't complete the script properly. Yeah, it all worked. Sweet. You must have been good at following instructions. I would say. <laughs> so, the Balrog. The Balrog has come in. Yeah. I hope you're having a ton of fun with that. It is an awesome mod, uh, which I spend two of my days in the week streaming. Um, Wednesday evening will be the next one for me. Be my high off playthrough. The super capture settlement before Moria, Dane got mad. Yeah, you're not meant to. It's none but none but Moria was the was the quest. Yeah. Did did it fail you? Did it fail the the campaign? Just warned me and said you better get more real quick. <laughs> nice. Then I got Moria, lost it, got same warning, died. Start over. <laughs> it's good, eh? It's good. It's good. I think the test of it is if you die or not, you know? I think dying is a good thing because it means that it's hard. Yeah, yeah, that's right. That's right. You know, dying is yeah. good. That's perfect. Holy cockamole, you've got my my uh, my attitude right there. Yeah. Okay. We're just going to ride through the night because we may as well. And there's no food to buy anywhere, so... Guy's always wandering on that stretch. Figuring it out is fun. Being good is boring. <laughs> yeah. Once you know how to do stuff, it's it's boring, right? It's the figuring out stuff is fun, yeah. Sometimes. I mean, I just spent half an hour trying to find a damn treasure. I'm not fighting you guys. Could fight you, but I'm not interested. I'm gonna keep heading back. Yeah, do you know, um, Wiz88, because I looked for the historic treasure number two, or legendary, whatever it's called, treasure number two, and couldn't find it. Yeah. Played this game when it came out, had a blast. Kingdom Come, yeah, it's a great game. Did you play it with all the DLCs? Um, if you just said when it played out, probably not. When it came out, probably not. But all the DLCs add so, all the DLCs add so much uh, content to the game. Yeah.
and uh, the hardcore mode makes it, I think, more fun because it's harder, and harder for me equals fun. But. So, Wiz88, are you still around to assist? Because the, um, didn't even finish it, put it down, came back a few months later and forgot how to combat. Uh, so this one we found, so it can go into the horse. This one, I reckon, is this mine shaft, just north of Ladeshko, unless I've got the wrong... That's LED, Ladeshko. Which would be this mine shaft. Right here, right? This one. That would be where we're looking. But I couldn't find any there. Um, so, look at number. Four, because I think it's around here summer as well. Rate, double bridge, take the left in the V. Yeah, I know where that is. Bandits around there, though. Yeah. Did say I gave myself a day to do this. Uh, we haven't had the full day yet. <laughs> Treasure hunting. Exhausting. Yeah. This way. Please never ambush. Please no ambush. Please no ambush. Oh, yeah. yeah. This go. Guess I am riding around at night, aren't I? Yeah. Just need to break off these guys from the ambush. I know we're looking over there, but I just need to put some distance between me and them so they stop. There we go. Yeah. Okay, so we're looking at these like ruins. Yeah, yeah. So somewhere in here. I'll have to get something to eat. I'm starting to get hungry. There's a bandit camp down there. Where's the map actually say? Let's be smart. So, inside the ruin, like at the edge. This side. Get in there? How do I get in there? Here to can I jump in there with my horse? <laughs> Try and jump in with the horse. Yeah. And on that side, apparently. Is 
that Rate? There's Rate over on the hill. I'm surprised I can see it. Right. It's not, is it somewhere not around there? There we go. Okay. We're we looking somewhere in here. Flare in, no. Aha. Found it. Us. Fashionable slippers, groschen, heavy warhammer, recipe for lullaby, save your schnapps, warhorse helmet, or shoes, nice. Avengers! Scott Beasy <laughs> raiding with a party of 13. Scott Beasy, welcome in. DCT, DCD Shaman, Goddess Mori, welcome, welcome, welcome. Thank you so much for the raid, Mr. Beezy. Let's go. Oh, you missed some, some quality stuff. Mainly me bumbling around in the woods at night. Um, but <laughs> welcome, everyone. Gotta figure out how to get back out of here. I just could have climbed up there. That would have been smart. <laughs> Mr. Beezy, yeah, don't mind this fellow. It's quite a merry time and he often gets confused. Treat him with respect. Horse. Thank you. Right. Thank you so much for the raid. Huge raid. Thank you so much. Uh, and welcome everyone to the stream. We are playing Kingdom Come Deliverance. Um, which is an open world RPG set in medieval Bohemia. We've been gall gallivanting around the countryside uh, looking for treasures the last three hours or so. Uh, an ambush there, but I mean, really, you guys want to, you, you want to die. You want to die? How heavily armored are you? Or are you just peasants? Oh, you just peasants. Oh, no. You're just peasants. Alright, let's get off the horse and fight them. They got nothing. Go get some food and sleep so I can get back on for a bit. Come on, let's go. What do you got? Gone weak at the knees, have you? Do <laughs> that one. Okay. Yeah. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, I get you, I get you. Stop it. Good of a fix. Stop. Is it? That combat. Oh. Ah. Uh, just me and you now, boy. Just me and you. Now you're fucked. No, it's really you. You had a chance with the three on one, but now with the one on one, you are in serious trouble. I'm head to bed, EPM, but I'll keep the lurk on. Thank you so much, DCT Shaman. Very much appreciated. Anyone else who's new to the stream? Yeah, boys, you shouldn't have tried to ambush me. I'm sorry, but you're dead now. Um, I play yeah. Kingdom Come once a week. Dota 2, I play three times a week. And I play Total War twice a week. So, a little bit of different uh, variety of content, but tonight is Kingdom Come night. Uh, which is one of my chill nights because it's single player compared to Dota 2, which is... Oh, shit. Okay, I guess we're going to Kuno's camp. Got to be with you. <laughs> uh, I'm looking for Sukuno. Sukuno? Uh, Baron Rickvold. Guess we're starting the side quest. Is it this is camp? <laughs> Oh. 
You won't get nothing out of him. You must be Radzig's man. I heard he was supposed to send someone. Yes, so Radzig sent me as a guide. I'm Henry. I'm Jakey. I'm and this here content. fella, we call the Stone. I can see why. What's up with him? Cat got his tongue? No. More like the dog got it. The executioner's dog. <laughs> when the executioner <laughs> ripped it out of him. Anyway, you better come along with me. I'll introduce you to the other fellas. Yeah. And chief. These here are the Bearman brothers. Petter and Jan. Mm. They're a barrel of laughs. Except mm. when they're too drunk to string two words mm. together. Like now. <clears throat> Don't get on the wrong side of them, though. When their blood is up... Don't you have to stay serious? Well, it ain't oh, pretty sad. Sometimes. I can be funny when I'm playing Dota. Pleased to make your acquaintance, I'm sure. Pleased to make your acquaintance, I'm sure. Never mind the fancy poses, Stefan. You're trying to kill the fucker, not teach him how to dance. Here and we you, go. This guy looks dangler. like he's in charge. Stand I'm a pro Dota ground. player. Don't let him lead you round by the nose. Dota three. Sir. Oh, his. Well, sir, this is Henry from Co. From Lord Kobler. Kobler. Oh, Abila. It's about time Rads had got round to this. We need someone who knows their way around these parts. Elite players get access. Sure, Move sure, fair the, enough. Uh, fair enough. Bowing and curtsying. We don't hold with that tomfoolery here. Jakey! Where the hell are you sneaking off to? Go to the farm and get water. The lads are thirsty. I feel like I'm not meant to come well, here in the dead of time. night. And you'll go next time, you ungrateful pup. Get your ass moving. Snot nosed brat. You pull him out of a pile. What's your name of the others and see if I can no, shoot you, you in? Talk. <laughs> Where were we? Yeah, just show my oh, last yeah. night's stream. Five Ooh, wins, one loss. Who knows these parts? So, you so know, I that was, can rely on you. That was Berman. good. That was Henry. Right. Well, as I said to Radzig, I don't want to carry any dead weight. We could find ourselves in some very tight situations where every sword counts. Oh. I know how to handle a sword, all right? I've heard a lot of fellas say that. I still ended up on the wrong one. Loss one loss of dough, but we don't lose ever. We'll <laughs> oh, find out. Shit. Stefan? Take a break. Oh shit, we're in. Dangler, let's find out what Harold here can do. Harold, Henry. Sure. No problem, Chief. Let's go. Come on, you want to test me out? Let's go. <laughs> shit. Right, I don't want to kill you. I will, I will hurt you, that proves the point. Come on. This meant to be some sort of test? Oh wow, smack me in the face. Come on dude, don't be like that, we're on the same team. I, mean, I thought we were going to practice with wooden swords, but you know, you just throw me straight in with the weapons. Come on, swing. Wish I had my sword out, not my axe. The axe was the one I had equipped. I guess I did want to level it up a bit. Pretty ambidextrous with the torch in one end and... Surely that's proving I know what I'm doing, right? Come on. Surely that's enough. Oh, fucking hell! They don't would have killed anyone else. There we go. You didn't fare badly at I all. prefer League because it's say. superior, but we all knew that. Us. Oh, jeez. Alright, good. Thanks. Glad to see I passed your test. Yet. You don't know what you're letting yourself in for. Can't agree with you there. <laughs> Dota is still the best MOBA. Yeah. Scott BZ is just trolling. Uh, Mayo 130. Who you know, wants to leave during daylight? Tell me something about Sir yourself. Sir Kuno, can you tell me something about yourself? We're not leaving during Drop daylight, the... are we? Sir, that title brought me nothing but grief. But what do you want to know? What do I want to know? Uh, how come you owe Sir Radzik? What about your debt to Sir Radzik? How did that come about? A twist of fate, lad. 
I was fighting in the hostilities between the house of Schallenberg and the town of Colleen. Some trade dispute it was, and I fought under the Schallenberg colours. In the end, the two sides negotiated a truce, and I rode to Colleen with the delegation that was <laughs> that to help explain. We stopped off at an inn on the way, and it was there that I met Radzig Kobila. I could tell at first sight he was a man after my own heart. A likeable rogue, with a sharp mind and a merry soul. We spent the whole night drinking together and talking. And in the morning, we set off together with sore heads, but in good temper. Yes, yeah, both travelling to Colleen together, but on the Only opposite sides. Once we reached the city gates, they arrested me on the spot. <laughs> <laughs> Seems the burgers had it in for Scott me. Scott doesn't, Mr. Beasy doesn't play either. Hell yeah. for a good six months. On the other hand, I was a member of the peace delegation, so by rights, they shouldn't have even looked at me sideways. And then it hit me why Radzig was there. Colleen is a royal city, so he was there to represent the king's interests. I see. So he was on the other side. That's right. Anyway, they threw me in a dungeon, and a few days later, word reached me that the Schallenbergs had reached an agreement with the Burgers. Only part of the deal was... They would give them my head. Cool. And I'd surely have ended my day swinging from the town battlements if it hadn't been for Rad's. Yeah, Mayor, uh, Scott doesn't he play either. And he can um, see it was a dirty he trick. just uh, trolls making... squared things with the when I council. play Dota, he tends to sleep and whatnot. Indeed. But he didn't know in the first place. It's a long story. I owe my life to Radzik, and I'll never forget it. He's asked me twice before for help. This is the third time. And how could I refuse him? How could you refuse him? The man saved your life. So Radzig told me the Rickvold family um, lost, lost its wealth. How did that happen? all sorts of ways to become impoverished. Nothing easier. Especially when your father's a fool. Yeah, father's a fool, mother's mad as a bat. bat. That would oh. make you impoverished. But it's a long and twisted story. We took our name from Rickvold Castle. But that actually belonged to the convent of the poor Clares in Tynitz. And my father only leased it. He's anyway... Whether he was fucking her right there in the convent, or he just took a lot of interest in scripture. Well, who would know? He spent an awful lot of time. Spent an in awful Tynes. lot of time there. <laughs> Maybe a bit of both. Some people are simply devout. Uh... <laughs> oh, you might have been after a bit of both. Sinning and confessing all in one place. Well, I can see the convenience of it. Anyway, <laughs> my mother never had strong nerves. This game doesn't hold Truth its punches told, on, on the church. Uh, it's, it's shaky. Good. It gives it to the Catholic Church Part's a bit. Part's escapades drove her cuckoo entirely. Then, one frosty December morning, I was woken by screaming and smoke. I looked out the window, and I saw my mother there in the courtyard, wreathed in flames. <laughs> yeah, that's stay for 20. Behind her, the stables, the farm buildings, and the tower were burning too. And she just stood there, shrieking with laughter. Christ, that sounds like a scene straight out of hell. Hellish it was, I can tell you. Me and my sister Adela and a few servants managed to get out before the whole place went up. But yeah, the, the hate for father. League is real from Dota players. Well, my little brother. Um, poor lad was only seven. My it, sister it, it and is I a tangible, after the fire. It's a tangible thing. It's measurable. Then my cousin, Adam of Drevich, took us into his castle. A few weeks later... He offered to buy what was left of our estates and sell me a small fortress near a Kovni. A small fortress. A relief. I'd like someone to sell he me a small had fortress. Some hope of a future again. I could do with a small fortress. So I told my sister about it. It's definitely something I could, and it could was the you biggest know, have interest in. Life. A week later, the two of them announced to me they were getting married. And all that was left of our estates, lands, woods, villages... Adela was to get it all as a dowry. I'm a smart player. Way better than both James. <laughs> you were the head of the family. No, that right? is incorrect. I? Only I barely Smite's a different had 17 game. years under my um, belt. So I, I can't, I can't measure it on the same scale as League and Dota. I argued with them. And that was the only excuse they needed to kick me out of Drevich too. It's a different Oof. game. That's pretty harsh. Different type of me. game. But I'm not complaining. As my pa always used to you say, you turn your hand to something, you'll you never be lost. Something. Yep. Right. Members of your band. I'd like who to ask you... about your. Ask away. Who are we learning about? Dangler. What about the fellow they call Dangler? I've never ridden with a better man, I can tell you. We're going to have to ride with these fellas, so we need to know about him. He listens all the better. Nothing escapes him. So he scouts for you. Not just that. 
It's happened more than once. I was closing a deal with someone, and Dangler told me after that he didn't like the smell of the fellow nearly every time he was right. And the fellow tried to stab me. Well, it'd in the be back nice afterwards. to have a fellow like Dangler around, wouldn't it? Tell us someone's going to stab Those you in the Berman back. Berman brothers are quite a pair. Indeed, they are. There's no more mercy in them than in, well, a bear. If I told them to skewer you on the spot, they'd do it without batting an eye. Well, that's comforting, Jesus. isn't it? Oh, I. They'd argue first about which one of them got to do the job. But they're as obedient as a huntsman's dogs. Real soldiers. Tim D. Oh. Reliable. I'm so sorry, Tim D. As long as they don't D. get too drunk. But you're going to be no keeping them having that comment removed in a moment. But once I get controlled my mouse again. Can I do it now? Here we go. Boom. See you later. What can you tell me Stefan. about Stefan? Stefan. Fletching. For one thing, he's, he's a very he's a resourceful bowman, is he? fellow. How did he come to join your band? Well, let's just say he was in the right place at the right time. You'll find he has quite a knack for that. What exactly happened? Sorry, I'd love to tell you the whole story, but I'd be betraying his trust. Fair enough. Oh, now you've yeah. got me curious. Maybe I should ask Maybe him I myself. Should ask him myself. Yeah. Sure. Why not? Our Fletch does love to converse. Okay, so I gotta ask Stefan about what about that dumb one? How did he end up with dumb? You? Meaning Stunt. can't speak. Oh, he just kind of tagged along. Tagged like, along? Just like that. We were riding from Olomots to a castle past Kladsko when we ran into him and some other wayfarers camping along the way. You know how it goes. We made acquaintance with them, had a drink or two. Then we travelled on together. After all, there's safety in numbers. I'm not sure I'd be thinking that if I ran into you lot on the road. <laughs> we might have done some things I ain't proud of. But Wayfair is a sacred... All harder, in my opinion, because the third-person aspect anyway, from the top view kind of hard to land things. Along the way. What about visual in a team fight? Does it not become too hard? You know, I prefer League or Dota for the Except top view, honestly. The stone. Yeah, it's a different game. The, the, you can't away. compare them. It's a different game. The fellas kept asking like comparing, who he was after. Like, of course, he never Call of Duty with, when we were with Age of Empires. Just a different game. I get rid of him. I had some business at the car. There are some similarities, but it's just different. Stefan tried to tell him nicely. But he just sat there, staring like he was turned to stone. That's when we gave him the name. Then the Bearman brothers tried to get him off his horse. He booted Yan in the face and knocked him out cold. Then he jumped down and fell Petter with one punch. Oh, a man who can do that is a man you want on your side. So we kept so him. We kept him. Good. Weren't you worried about having a stranger in your band? Especially one who didn't talk. No. I figured if you can't talk... Team players give me away a lot. Uh, welcome Sucks. to Dota. I've had worse. Welcome to Dota. Last person, Jakey. What about Jakey? Jakey. The boy. That boy will be the death of me. You've got to be tough on him, or he's good for nothing. But I'm fond of him, in a way. Like a son? I wouldn't go that far. But I've no family of my own. And unlike those, those other, other cutthroats, cut he he's seems a good to be lad. Like, he's a good lad twisted up in a bad like business. Like a good lad. Well, you're pretty hard on him, though. And the others keep him on his toes, too. A boy needs a firm hand. I was like him once, and I got the same, too. If we let him be, we'd end up with a third bear man. <laughs> Who wants Who that? Want yeah, that? no one. Hmm. True. Two is more than enough. Right. So we're not setting off back and dialogue. Right. He said he wants to set out in daylight, right? Uh, excuse me. Right out on the first mission, Kuno wants to leave during daylight. It's certainly not daylight right now, and we need to get some horse. Where's the horse? Over here. Uh, we need to get some sleep. Yeah. I, mean, I guess we could sleep there. Yeah. Is there food here? Probably not. Uh, I want I want to get some yeah. food in town, so I've got some food to go on travels with them, and then we'll uh, we'll head out tomorrow to go on the first mission. We're riding out. So the band of bastards, the lads, they are that we just all learn about. They are here to try and clear the the surrounding lands of rabble. 
that have been left behind after Sigismund's horde came through and uh, dec decimated the land. So we're going to clean it up. We're going to get rid of any bandits and, and whatnot that are skunking around. There's a lot of flaming and griefing as well. Yeah. I mean, any multiplayer game, there's going to be there's going to be a bit of flame. Man, I'm hungry. Apparently, eat, eat. Can we food? Uh, let's have some. Let's fill up on some beer, shall we? Uh, that'll be most that we have to do. Sleep and save. Back to that. Right, let's get some... No one ever wants to play as Guardian or Warrior. Yeah, I mean, that's like me and Dota, but I, I always happily play support. Um, and that's what I'm best at. Watch ourselves. I mean, someone's got to play the role that no one else yeah. wants to do. That's the way it is. Put the torch away, shall we? So, we're going to... Go into town. Why is that bow not equipped? Uh, put that on the horse. New bow. Horse. 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 Put that on. Fix up our gear since we got into a bit of a brawl there. Back a little bit with those bandits. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Let's not read on the horse, shall we? Um, Ayla's kit. Thank you. Right. Yeah. However, we have wrecked people using all mages before. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. In Dota, it's, uh, it's the same. You can win with anything. It's more about the attitude of the people on your team. You know, you can have any five combination of heroes and still win a game. It's, it's more about the attitude of the people on your team than anything. Um, you know, and, and that is even true of high level, Implements, you know, high level Dota as well. God save. Some teams have proved that over the over the time. It's more about team chemistry and and you know what you can bring to the table as a group. Uh, let's get a couple of pieces of bread. Definitely get the dried fruit because we're going to be out in the road, it looks like, for a bit. Dried mushrooms, we'll grab those. The fine wine. Honey, that doesn't go off as well. Um, Alright, that's good. Let's... There's the deal. Now, apparently we're very hungry, so let's have a bite to eat. That. Actually need another piece of bread, to be honest. You take that food. Yeah, the fact that Smite is on consoles, I reckon, would increase the toxicity. I mean, that's that's making quite a statement about console players, isn't it? But um, <laughs> I mean, I'm more more that I don't know what I'm saying there. <laughs> Goldsmith, do you broken. have blacksmith's kits? See you later. Yes. Grab one of those. Fantastic. And we'll repair our... Yeah, that one was wrecked. We didn't even have it. Um... Everything for the house. Garden and field. Nine. Now, there's a slight concern I have here that one of my quests is time sensitive. Um... But yeah. this guy did say he wanted to set out in the morning with daylight, so let's go over to Sir Kuno and we'll do one with him. And we'll see what the time frame is at the end of that, whether we have time to do stuff. Because there's this um, Sir Hand's quest that has... I don't think it's time sensitive, but if it is, it'd probably be about a week. So, I mean, a week in game time, so... I think I've had it for a couple of days in game time at the moment, so just need to be careful of that.
But let's go up to Sir Kuno and join the band of bastards and go for a, a ride around the countryside. See what we come across. Has its pros and cons. Don't have any issues playing against PC. Yeah, um... Normally people on PC, I think, are a little more in control than people on consoles. And that's a huge generalization, of course, but... I mean, that's a huge generalization. Probably more about the age of the people that um, Can you tell me something are using about it. Yourself, yeah. I think younger kids have more access well, to consoles. I haven't been to confession for a while. <laughs> How did you end up in Kuno's band? And younger ah, people, generally as a rule, don't have better control over their emotions, since right? We were old enough to carry swords. What happened? Nah, we just wanted to come back to Bohemia. You know how it is. When no one understands a word you say, it ain't worth a damn. Well, if you're speaking... You and Petter seem very close. Czech right now, I'd be in trouble. Should be lad. Good thing you're translating nah, English for me. Truth. I'd never have guessed the two of you came from the same mother. Oh, we've got the same ma, all right. I ain't got no ma, and neither does he. <laughs> and the same goes for Humor our Humor of an orphan. It's probably Satan himself. Oh. I'm a bit confused. You're not actually brothers. We might be. We might not. We might not. A band of mercenaries found us in a village when I was still a baby, and better hardly walking. Playing in the dirt together we was. Their leader took a shine to us for some reason. He took us away and raised us up. Raised, raised us, us with, with swords, swords for, for playthings. And ale, ale for mother's, for mother's milk. milk. A few years wow. later, he was killed in Saxony. The band fell apart, but we joined another right away. That's the way it's been ever since, over and over. So you two never had, well, um, a normal life. We ride from one fight to another, risking our necks and killing who they pay us to kill. That's normal for us. Always has been. Fair enough. So the Bearman brothers. What about you? You're the other brother. Let's see what you have to say. Tell me something. What do you want to know? How did you and Yana? Me and my brother been riding with coin men since we was little. This was just another mercenary band for so us. So not that important for but you. But Kuno seemed like a decent kind of fellow who'd treat us fair. Your brother was saying you rode before with some Kalini fella. He did, did he? Did he tell you why we finished with him? Why we finished yeah. with him? He said you missed Bohemia. Miss Bohemia. <laughs> Miss Bohemia. That's good. <laughs> you stab him in the back. <laughs> but it ain't far from the truth. Yeah, missed any place where he wouldn't have a band of furious Italians looking to skin him alive. <laughs> yeah, they ah. had to get out. He did something to anger them. Oh, aye. While Colini was away, he broke into the trunk where the coin was kept. Took it all and wagered it with a fellow who claimed his bear knew how to dance and lost it all. <laughs> the bear really did dance. Aye. The costliest chardash we ever watched. We had to get the fuck out of there before Colini came back and had the two of us dancing. On the end, on the of, end a of a rope. rope. Gotta love the, the medieval execution humor. Fantastic stuff. Uh, so we've talked to Kuno. Kuno here, right? Uh, what about... Henry, Jakey. come here. You seem like a what good lad. Jakey? The stone wants to talk with you. If you can call it that. Probably, Probably about, about, that, about ring. that ring. What ring? What ring? Ah, no one told you about it. The fellas call it the Ring of Bacchus. It's a kind of game we play. Kuno gave us That's this a quest ring. within a quest, it's it looks like. It's just a worthless bauble. But when we're at the tavern, Kuno pays everything for the man who has the ring. So we steal the ring from each other and try to trick each other. Well, actually, just the others. They, they won't, won't let, let me play. play. Kuno says I'm too young to get boozed up. <laughs> that sounds like a lot of fun. But I don't have the ring, so why does the stone want to see me? He probably wants you to steal it from someone. Since you're new, the fellows will talk to you, and it won't be suspicious. All right. Okay. Tell me something hey, about Jakey. yourself. Can the you ring tell me Bacchus. something about yourself? Want to get matey, eh? Sure, Henry. What do you want to know? How did you end How'd up, you end up here? Well, you're I good, used you're to a good be lad. a good hand in Prague. But all the other fellows were always on my back, always swearing at me. Sometimes they even beat me up, took everything I had. To make a bit of coin, I started going to the tavern across the road. Entertaining the rich gents with jokes, playing the fool. Sometimes someone with the jester, half the clown. One time, Kuno turned up there, and I got to talking with him. When I told him all the shit I was getting at the bakery, he offered to take me with him. 
Oh, wow. Bet you were glad to get out. Yeah, though it's not like they give me much peace here either. It's all... Jakey, Jakey come here. Come Jakey, here. you're there. Jakey. Couldn't be I'm worse sure than the bakery. No. Only at the bakery, the worst I ever got was a beating. It's not like my life was in danger. But here, when those Beerman brothers are drunk, I have to keep well out of sight. <laughs> How come they bullied you at the bakery? It's usually the shy ones bullies pick on. That's not exactly you. Not now, maybe. Learned a thing or two since then. He's adapted. Oh, come on, you, Humor is a defense, me defense you mechanism. You said you were playing the fool and telling jokes in the tavern. All right, I'll tell you the truth. They picked on me because I'm an orphan. The parish priest of St. Apollinaire's in Prague found me as a baby in the church one winter's morning. Another orphan. I spent half my childhood in parish houses are and half on the street. I see. I guess they're called band of bastards that for must a have reason. Been tough. It still is tough, I can tell you that. Okay. Talk to Jakey. Talk to the bearman. So we got Fletcher and the stone still to talk to. Let's talk to Fletcher. There we Stefan, can you tell me something about uh, what is it you want to know, youngster? This guy looks like a good fellow. I'm curious how you ended up in Kuno's band. You notice I don't exactly fit in with this pack of felons and reprobates, huh? Unfortunately, you can't always choose your company. Yeah, he looks like a respectable fellow. No, I suppose not. But how did you come to be with them? Oh, well, I'd love to tell you, but Kuno insisted we keep that between the two of us. And I'm not one to break a confidence. Oh. But, well, Kuno said it was you who wanted to keep yeah. it secret. Really? <laughs> Are you sure about that? You must have misunderstood him. No, I don't think so. At least... Oh, never mind. Something going on between so, these two. where did you live before? What did you do? I used to live in a town before. Back there I was doing something very different. Although... Now I think of it, maybe it wasn't that different in a way. If you know what I mean. Not really. Actually, I have the foggiest idea what you mean. <laughs> you don't give anything away, do you? Me? <laughs> I'm an, open, I'm an book. open book lad. Ask me anything you like and I'll give you an honest answer. Go on. Uh, maybe another time. My head's starting to spin. Yeah. As you wish. Shame, though. There's nothing I enjoy more than conversing. <laughs> he did say he does like a good converse. Now, why is there an option to play dice with him? There's something else going on there. You know, Jakey. Where's the other lad? Bearman. Oh, over here. Is this the stone, or is this Dang? No, this is Dangler. Can you tell me something about your? What do you want to know? Why do they call you Dang? Because Kuno found me dangling on the end of a rope. Fair uh, enough. I see. So, um, he saved you from execution? I wouldn't call it an execution exactly. At the time, I was squire to the Lord of Buzitz. There was a proper night for you, full of ideals and honour. I looked up to him as a hero. Then in one skirmish, he was killed, and the foe took me captive. They stood me on a shaky wooden cross with my hands tied behind my back and a noose around my neck for amusement. Then they rode off laughing. Well, how long hey. were you stuck there? I couldn't tell you. Hours, Hours, maybe days. Maybe days. In the end, everything started going black. I could feel the devil pulling me down by the legs. Jesus. How on earth did you survive? I didn't. When Kuno found me, dead as a doorna. he says I was dead as a doorna. They cut me down and took the rope off me. Then someone gave me a kick and I coughed and came back to life. Sort of. Sort of. Never been the same since. Guess that'd do it to you. Um, where is Stone? Whatever his name is. Is this him over here? Wayfarer. That it was this priest who was always complaining about his teeth to everyone. Yeah. Down look at. Where's the stone at? You guarding the other end of the other end of the camp? I know where he is. Him over here. Stone. Can't talk. Jakey sent me to you. 
something about a ring? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I suppose you want me to get it from someone? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Who has it? Uh, Jakey. Jakey? Mm-mm. Who knows? You mean... Mm-mm. Jan... Mm-mm. Petter Bear... <laughs> I didn't quite... Is, is it Fletching? Mm-mm. Does Dangler have it? Dangler? Mm. Mm. Dangler right. has it. How should I get it? <laughs> Shrug your shoulders. Hey. Right. Anything else to learn about you? No. Ah. The ring of Bacchus from Dangler. I mean, he's just standing there. Like, he wants to be lockpicked. Not lockpicked. Uh, pickpocketed. Now, I did this one before we go on the ring of Bacchus. I mean, this one seems to be put on hold for the time being. Get the ring of Bacchus from Dangler. Uh. What happens if I fail here? Does he start attacking me? That can't be good. Seriously, dog. Got the ring. Nice. Successful pickpocket. The bread as well, actually. I might might eat that. I'll eat the pretzel. Get rid of the get rid of the evidence that we're stealing anything. Bread. Have that as well. Nice. I got the ring from Dangler. Hmm. Yeah. Well, I, uh, I suppose there's not much more either of us can say about it. Mm mm. Mm mm. <coughs> uh, yeah. Thanks to you too. Okay. Balance is golden and other miss number four. The ring is sought after as the Holy Grail. Let's see who wants it next. Seriously, so I gotta talk to people again to see who wants it. That's it. That's the information I have. All right, let's let's ride out on our little um. Right. Maybe this guy wants it next. I need to talk to someone to see who wants it next. Maybe the Bearmans. One of these two want it next. <laughs> Doesn't look like it. Well. So we're all full up. We'll work it off over the day. So Kuno. Should we ride out? Aye. We ought to set out on patrol about now. Hope you've got your kit ready and whatnot. Yeah, I'm ready to I'd go. I'd like to head to the north. Is there anything interesting that way? North of here, uh, Samapesh and Merhoyed are that way, and Talmberg is a bit further on. There's stables in Merhoyed. I wouldn't mind paying a visit to those stables. We can go through there. And from there? From there, we'll follow our noses. Something interesting is sure to turn up. Feel it in my bones. Man up and let's go. Man up and let's go. Sure. Righto. Chief. Chief. Bad blood started. Oh, we're off. Free Samapesh. Hello, Kuno and his band. Ride beside you know, shall we? What a fine day, eh, brother? Indeed, brother. You know what I like best about days like this, yeah? Mm, the scent of chamomile wafting from the hillsides. Among other things. Ah, like the rounded hills, rising, perky, all soft and pink in the sunlight. And the fertile valley below, spreading wide and inviting. You Where's Jakey? I was going to say, Jakey's at the back. Hollow. The sweet like the aroma engine. of honey in the air. The sturdy poplar, standing tall 
and erect. I. It reminds me of that day. That day. Where the two of us fucked Fletch's ma. <laughs> Schoolboy humor. Very Quality stuff. You make a stuffed bird laugh. Your ma's a stuffed bird. <laughs> Fletcher definitely. I stuffed her myself. <laughs> Fletcher definitely doesn't fit in this crew. I can't smell any chamomile. Well, men, how are things? May I? Yes, Fletch. How shall I put it? I'm a little concerned about the prospects in these parts, Chief. Oh? How's that? I've been looking around, and if you'll pardon me, it seems to me that we've been stuck for a long time in the arsehole of beyond. It's not Paris, France, I'll grant you. What I mean to say is, I haven't got any new kit or arrows since the day Jakey joined me. It makes me uneasy, Chief. I see. What about the rest of you? I don't know what Fletch is moaning about. There's plenty of booze and loose wenches nearby. Not to mention fools in the taverns who don't know when to stop rolling those dice. Dangler? It's the arsehole of beyond everywhere we go. And it always makes me uneasy. Always Jakey. makes you uneasy. Fletch can complain. I was supposed to get a suit of armor, and all I got was a shitty kettle hat. Sorry, but they don't do hoberks in girl sizes. Oh, gee. Oh, well, how did Savage. you get yours then? All right, I appreciate your honesty, lads. Don't worry, there will be plunder. No one asks the stone because he can't talk. The victim mm -mm. spoils. Mm -mm. And so it's always been. But no purse of silver will shed blood for you on the battlefield. That's what this company is for. And I hope you never forget the golden rule. You can joke all you want, moan all you want, but nothing will keep your skins in one piece better than trusting your leader, who you choose by your own free will. So don't ever forget that. Oh, man. Chief, I think there's something going on over there. Let's go! Behind me, and keep your eyes peeled. Right now, let's go. There's a fire. Yeah. Something's on. Wish these guys had better riding skill. Behind you. If you don't ride a little faster. What do you think we can expect this time, fellas? Groshen. Hidden in a piss pot under the bed. Groshen. Hidden in a piss nice pot under the bed. No one's oh, there. no. On a yeah. girl, it'd just fall out through the holes in their bellies. Hey, brother? <laughs> <laughs> My mouth is already watering, brother. And I ain't even touched a yeah. purse yet. Once you get your hands on some loot, I'll be happy to play you. Yeah. Yeah. hard there, Groshen. Poor old Fletch yeah. never gets to see the action from close up. What about you, Dangler? What do you expect to find? Futility and human suffering. Mark always. always Futility and human cheer, suffering. Eh, this guy's the realest of the crew. Why don't you take a leaf out of stone? Search the burnout shut farm. The Jesus. I wish you'd all shut the fuck up. Oh. So we are searching the burnout farm. Try and find traces of the attackers. Okay. Keep your eyes peeled, though. There might be someone hiding out here still. Look for clues. Question the survivors. Question the survivors. He doesn't look like he's surviving anything. You alive? He's still breathing, sort of. The blood here. Hmm. Still smouldering. Whoever torched it can't have got very far. Good point. Good point. I mean, wood will smoulder for a while. Mother of God. Down one person. Oh, no good. Jesus Christ! What a massacre! Looks like it happened fast. Arrows. We can't be all that clever or they'd have taken the wagon. God almighty. Which is what a blacksmith son would say. They've say taken the wagon. They weren't even armed. 
is to hit and run. Anything to find in here? Clothes. Maybe one of them got injured on the way out. Maybe. There'll be a blood trail. I'm hoping for anyway. Turn that. That over here. Nothing over here. No signs of resistance. They simply slaughtered them like animals. Out in here. Someone's still alive in here. to know about this house of zul shield message for sir radzik well, poor wretch the dog as well far out they were they didn't hold back did they the dog as well and nothing here We got the other second part of it here. Try and find traces of the attackers. Well, surely they would have left somewhere. It would have come from the woods, right? Don't know what I'm looking for here. How far afield am I meant to go? I'm meant to stay within the area? I haven't checked around the back of... They turned the place over good and proper. I haven't checked around the back of here, I don't think. Wash myself. I can't see any traces of you know blood marks or you no know, blood stains sort of leaving the area from what I can see. Worthless trinkets. Not even Fletch could flog this lot. You found anything interesting? Fuck all. They cleaned them out good and proper. But one fellow was still alive. Alive? Did he say anything? Did he tell you anything? Nah. Uh, he mumbled something about some Lord something. Zool, I think. Oh, that would make Zool. sense. I never. Me neither. But I don't know too many nobles. There we are. Let's two... start with your boots for a change. <laughs> Just, just cleaning them out. Um, so we got two things about connecting Zul. Have you found anything about you? Fletch, who's the tracker? Dangler. This guy's walking out here. Do you anything to say? Yeah, he does. Any tracks? Did you find any tracks? Some, a horse or two. They rode off through the meadow towards dawn. They were avoiding the road. Which is interesting. Towards dawn? Meaning towards the east. Yeah, Henry, come Apart on. Apart from the mounted ones, there were some men on foot too. Well weighed down. Well, they can't move too fast then. No. And what's more, they left a trail of blood. Ah. One or more of them might be wounded. Either that, or they dragged off some poor bastard from here. Nice work. Thanks. Okay. So, found out which way they went. So, do we now talk to Kuno? Track the raiders. 
Hey. Promising. Poor creature. Hunted down like game. Yeah. Looks like they carried away a lot of stuff. They went this way. Okay. Seems they met some resistance at the farm. Ugh, what a waste. But at least I know which way they went. We just keep on this path then. Found him. Supposing eight was heading my way and another eight your way, then we'd have went before. How do I get to register on the on the quest log though? Hasn't registered yet that I've tracked him to here. Um I don't really want him to come after me right now because I that would be against the quest line. There they are. Nice. Alright, good. Back the raiders. Yeah. I'm only gonna deal with the raiders by myself, that's for sure. Ride back around, go talk to Kuno that we found him. Good to see I'm working hard around here than anyone, apparently. Right, tell them what we found and where they're at. Letter and shield. I found this shield in a shed along with a letter. Seems like someone left us a message. Show me that. Hmm. I know that crest. It's the, the House of Zul. Dangerous lot. God's truth. Fair enough. I don't think we'll find anything else here. We'll stay here a while, just in case. And you should go and report to Radzig what happened. What do you know about these Zuls? A family of impoverished nobles. They fought in the Margraviate Wars in Moravia. But what they're after in Bohemia... No idea. no idea. Okay. Track down That's the raiders. All. I tracked down those raiders. You did? Where are they? A short way to the east, in a glade in the woods. They're dividing up their loot. How many of them are there? Maybe seven. About seven. Hmm. We'll see. I'll tell the lads we're going to deal with them. Nice and quiet. Hey! To me! Now! Let's go. We're doing it. Listen up! Henry tracked down those bastards who raided the farm. They're dividing up their loot. There's not Dangler far from and Jake. Here. So let's pounce on them and give them what for. Move out! We taking the horses or are we running? We're running. 
Where's Dangler? Here he is. I was going to say we're one man short. I think it'd be smarter to take the horses, lads. Just out of. You know. Be a good idea. Probably should be leading him since I know where it is. As the grave. As the stone would say. That's a good one. I haven't heard that one since. Let me see. Yesterday. At a loss for words, are you? <laughs> Stop it. Please. Or I'll split my sides laughing. I feel sorry for the stone. Imagine not being yeah. able to insult your enemy's mother. Ah, big mouth Jakey makes up for it. I don't know how you managed without me for so long. I know. Are they the only one with an axe? Everyone else has got swords. Let's go, lads. I tracked them down for you. Now we gotta get in. Who wasn't needed their in. back cover last time? Jakey. Jakey. Fuck you. I don't need minding. We all cover each other's backs. That's how this band works. Get used to it. I've no intention of getting myself killed by a bunch of bandits who pillaged a farm for cabbage. Well, I don't know. You might get mistaken for a cabbage yourself. Aye, he's green enough. <laughs> green enough. They give it I'll to Jakey. Got it? Thanks a lot, Fletch. Yeah, they wouldn't see us coming, would they? This isn't quite like this has gone straight in. Get him. Yabba! Very nicely done, lads. Very nicely done. Now we're chilling here with the loot. I like that faint stripe from the left, brother. Yeah, nice trick. What do you call that? Secret of the trade, Sonny. You believe him, bro. You lost your puff fighting that other fucker, didn't you, brother? Nah. I was just faking it. To I mean, can I loot this? The piercing arrow will take. There's no Zools here. Hard telling who's who there in the midst of the battle. I guess that's how it would be, would have been in real life. Hard to tell who's friend and who's foe. You don't want to axe your, axe your, your you know best, like best, best mate in the back. Pray tell, brother, when there's one last fuck, we surround. I reckon I did hit someone with an arrow there. I let it loose and I think I saw someone with an arrow in their helmet. So that worked out. Take the bread, I need some to eat. The loot. Good as well, that's good as well. That guy was quite quite good gear. It'll look more like a battle plan, eh? But when your blood's up. Aye. Plans go to hell in the heat of battle. Everyone's still going to lay into that last fucker with everything they've got anyway. Take that, thank you very much. Noble's gear, gee, some of that was heavily armoured. I think I this is why I stabbed in the back, honestly. Shitting his brains as usual. The only place I'll be shitting is in your tent. Somewhere over here as well. I think we have to, I think it'll fit on the horse. Not all of them had big stuff, but the horse was empty, so could have been empty. 
the lads are over there just comparing sizes, so we're not missing out on anything. Right. So let's chuck any of that on the bike tool hammer on the horse. That have, have that. Chuck it. can't carry any more. Uh, that's not good. Other, can you chuck something else on there? These ones? Maybe just one of them? No, it's, they are, he's out. Horse is... No, can't, can't even carry that, righto. So. Is there any loot here open? Russian. Level shoes. You can get hold of it and knock the weapon right out of his hand. And let him have your blade right in his side. A greenhorn's mistake. I keep thinking about that grass though. You know what I like best in a skirmish, Jan? Pray tell, brother. When there's one last fucker left. We surround him. Oh, yeah. him you don't want to talk? No. Let's go. Right we'll have a look around here for uh, clues. I love uh, that. Clues. Yeah, I've <laughs> already you learned you that. Ought to Henry, wager on who you go and report to Ratsy. A new wager? Fletch will be up for that. We've got to do something to spice things up. Oh, yeah. Make it more like a proper war. So we got to go talk to Ratsy. Of course. It'll look more like a battle plan, okay. eh? But when your blood's up... Aye, plans go to hell in the heat of... So this was like in here somewhere. He boars. It was across here. Like yeah, we're just in here somewhere. So I have to go report to Radzik. Is bad blood? Go report to Sir Radzik. Right. Yeah. And now I'd like to do the Game of Thrones side quest. So we'll go. Into Rate from the north ish. Uh, we have that one uh, quest to do with the boys, Andrew and Fritz, as well, but we've got we're actually a competent, a competent uh, band to work with at the moment, so we'll stick with them for the time being. I got a bunch of loot to sell anyway from um, from there. Because I still have the, the gear on me from all of the looting the treasures. So still have a bit, bit to uh, go through. And some of that's unique gear I'll probably hang on to. No, I don't need to sell it. If it's like a war horse one I'll probably keep it. It's like a set. So we'll ride in, talk to Radzig, uh, then go to the miller, talk to him, and then depending on how the conversation with Radzig goes, if it seems like it's time sensitive or not, um, we'll decide on whether we go do the quest for Sir Hands, because I'm just conscious of the timing on that. Because that one sounded like there might be a time element to it. Yeah, Capon's, Capon's in love. And he might get angry if we don't get his yeah. necklace back sooner rather than later. All the executions are gone after their uh, failed attempt in town. Feels good, man. Their bun bungled attempt.
think the horse does run slower when you're completely loaded down. I mean, I'm pretty much loaded as much as I can be. And so is the horse, so... We are pretty full up. Gallop, 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 gallop. There's hands. Tell me this is where Radzik is. Yeah, good. I was going to say, if he's not here, that'd be a shame. That looks an awful lot like me. Hmm. Here he is. I'll talk to you. Oh. Greetings. Sir, I'm afraid I have some bad news. We came across a burnt-out farm near Merhoyed. Christ! It seems Pribislavitz wasn't the end of it. Now this is something else, sir. We found a shield there with a crest. A tricolour star on a blue field. I know that coat of arms. The House of Zul. It's the House of Zul. There was a letter there, too. Show it to me. Although I think I already know what it will say. Here you are, sir. I didn't read it. I wonder if I could actually and read the letter. Beast. Mm -hmm. Cruelty and malevolence. Uh, I challenge you to face me in a duel, defend your honor. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Anonymous wretch. Well, that's nice. That's nice. Yeah, flower, flower Signed, language. Holy letter. Zool. As Hagen I expected, Zool. old grievances coming back to haunt me. Hagen wants to Mr. fight Hagen you. Hagen wants to challenge you to a duel. Apparently, he still hopes I will agree to this kind of outmoded solution to disputes. But surely you can't refuse a challenge to a duel. What about, what your, about honor? your honor? <laughs> Henry, my boy, honor is a splendid thing, and it should be held in high regard. <laughs> but in time, you'll learn that some matters are not so straightforward. Like this one? Yeah, like, don't yes, go like get yourself one. killed. The only reason Hagen is challenging me now is that he has a marked advantage. I've served as the royal hetman for the last 15 years and become a courtier. Hagen, meanwhile, was fighting in the Margraviate Wars in Moravia, and elsewhere as a mercenary. Which of us do you think would win a duel? That's not honor, but an abuse of honor. Commonplace opportunism. Mm. I don't blame him for trying, but I'm not such a fool as to play by his rules. Absolutely. You know, fool... What's what the dispute between you and Sir Hagen? That's a long story. Just the gist of but it? If I'm to know what I'm up against, I'll need to hear at least the gist of it. True. All right, in a nutshell. Several years ago, I had to resolve a bloody feud between the Zools and another family. The Zools were clearly in the wrong, but refused to accept my ruling. So, I hanged the head of the family. Raised, raised their, their castle, castle to the to ground. The and confiscated their property. Well, that would Ever cause... Ever since then, they've had it in uh, Not surprisingly. Yeah, not surprisingly. But you acted in good conscience. Yes. Although in retrospect, it might seem excessively harsh. And it doesn't help that the other family is related oh, to mine. Oh, gee. Whoops. Whoops. What are we going to do? What are we going to do about this? You and Kuno's band will just have to deal with Hagen and prevent further mayhem. The longer he's marauding around these parts the greater the chances that I'll finally have to succumb to his conditions. So you'd fight him if it came to that? Let's hope it doesn't come to that. Yeah, but we'll protect you, maybe there's something sir. else behind this challenge. Maybe it's coin he's after. Who knows? All right. We'll deal with him, sir. We'll deal I'm with sure him. I'm sure you will, Henry. Good luck, then. Okay. Question. Do I get... Yeah, the House of Zul's shield. Oh, it's like 98 defense, 168 defense, 17 charisma, 20 charisma, 1 durability. Yeah, so this was just a ornamental, ornamental shield, basically. All right. Bad blood completed, but I mean, there's a whole. I think there's there's a whole bunch of quests to do with the band of bastards. So, yeah, meet with Kuno in the encampment. Yeah, so we're not. Now, I don't think, there was nothing there that made me think that it's awfully time sensitive that we yeah. go do this immediately now. Um, 
So I'd like to do the other quest I have on the docket because there's a chance it might be. So I'll just sell all my gear so I'm not... Uh... He did say the longer he's marauding around, but I mean, we, we, we should have some time between now and when we need to do that. Uh, where is... Here he is. My good seller man. Sidekicks. Sorry. Anything that is a... Uh, I'll decide when I'm selling to him. There's some things I want to keep, but we'll put it all across here. Some were unique uh, armors from the from the maps. Right, let's sell. Greeting. I do want to have a nice bit of cash on me. I've got some goods. goods. Here. All right. Bye. Right, weapons. I mean, I guess I'll keep that, but I can't see why really. Uh, yep, they're fine. Two Bailer's Mace. No, we only need one Bailer's Mace. Um, the Warhammer, Hunting, Shield, Hunting Sword, Spike, Warhammer, Torch. Those. It's got 80k. That's how much we sold to him. Uh, other. Both of those. And in cloth, sure. Probably read those. Silver goblet, wool fabric, and then armor. Keep this one. Grand bassinet. Sell, sell, sell. Keep that one. Sell, 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 sell. Sell those two. Sell, 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 sell. Short Noble, that one I've got, Long Noble. What's the difference between Short Noble and Long Noble? 14, 17, 10? Fourteen, seventeen, ten. 17, 10? 100, 10, 70. 100, 10, 70. Uh, weight, 14. Weight, 14. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know why it's any different. Add a basket. Uh, 1445, 1855, yep. Add those to the basket. No. Well, add to the basket. Both of those, silver spurs, van braces. Now we'll keep the warhorse stuff, because that's like a set. We'll hold on to that. That was the new, new unique one we got as well. So. What's the deal? <coughs> Even look at how much we made. A lot. The short answer. Now, those maps. So it was sidekicks one, three, and five. Inventory other. One, three, five. It was also four as well. At four as well. Uh, now we've read one of these books. Oh, it's gone though. Uh, weapons, we'll put that across.
those across as well. Okay. That looks pretty good. Eat some food. Brick goes bad. Okay, and then we want to. Read that. Okay. And I'm thinking, let's sit down and read a couple other books while we're here as well. This is while we're organizing inventory, so just we can get them out of the way. Do that. And I would like to ride to Sasau tonight. Good. Finished. No. Not high enough skill level. Not high enough skill level. Already read this book. I had a tavern one. I must have already put it away. Okay, so we'll chuck them in as well. So, other recipe move. 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 Did I not read that. Recipe for lullaby? I already know the recipe. Okay. Back across as well then. Well, I don't know why it's still showing as, um, like, got the asterisk next to it, like, I haven't read it. Okay. Party up my kit. And so we had that little stoush. And Taylor's kit. All right. I think we're all tidied up. Uh, so I'd like to ride to can't say anything with you. Hail the uh, like Would to go you somewhere? Like to take a it's a bit late. A bit dark. Okay. Cool. Let's ride to Sasau tonight. Yeah. We're going to do the Ring of Bacchus as well when we get back to the camp. The Ring of Bacchus before we do the next sort of camp, next uh, quest with Kuno will be what we want to do. And then we'll keep doing that Band of Bastards side quest once we have helped out Sir Hands a little bit. They don't hate me in Sasau anymore, so that's good. We'll, we'll keep, we'll be happy about that. I should have a pretty fat load of coin. I don't even look how much I have to buy myself out of any predicament I get into. Considering it looks like I'm going on a gambling quest, um, having a fair chunk of money sounds like a good idea to start with. <laughs> yes, I know, you're tired. We'll trot for a little bit. Canter, rather. This is a canter. Trot, canter, gallop. So this would be a trot. Canter. Yeah. Gallop. Yeah. Oh. 
Oh, that was that was a big jump. One way to get into yeah. town. <laughs> just just jump over everything. Hi. Uh, yeah. Probably should. I don't know if the bathhouse is still open. I suspect it won't be. Oh, maybe it is. Maybe it is. Quick, 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 quick. Have a quick little. Mother. Yeah. Have a I'd quick like bath make... so uh -huh. that we don't look so terrible. Yeah, myself. I'm sure you. Good luck. Good. Got to look the part, or our charisma will be terribly low. Yeah. So we washed our clothes and had a bath ourselves. Yeah, so if you're watching over on, looks like me, doesn't it? If you're watching over on YouTube, um, be sure to like, subscribe, and comment. Ah! Okay. <laughs> be sure to like, subscribe, and comment, and I'll see you in the next episode. Have a good one.